the heart of El Money City Hall West, it's El Money Tonight with your host, Arturo Esparza. Tonight's guest lineup, Dr. Wen Li Jen. We also have Maggie Ramirez from the Ohm Wellness Center and Isaac Medina, as well as our guest band, the Bob DeSena Band. And I'm yours truly, Miss Jamie Neary, wishing you a very happy Easter. Take it away, Bob DeSena. Come on, boys. <laughs>
Bob the Santa band. You know what? what? Next time, play the long version, dude. Yeah, man. Night in Tunisia, man. That was too good, man. Man, I tell you. Well, here we are once again. El Monte, is that my camera? El Monte tonight, that little show around the corner and up the block from where you live in beautiful downtown El Monte, California, City Hall West, the Beverly Hills of the San Gabriel Valley. We love it. Yeah. yeah. I tell you, man. That's where it's at, man. I'd like to thank everybody here for tuning in. We're sorry we were off last week, and we're going to be off next week. Unfortunately, we'll be back back on schedule. One of my people, once again, we got some new shows coming on up. We have uh, The Healthier You with Wendy, and, of course, we have, what's that, Louis Mendez, City Lou's News Review, or was it Sports News? I'll get the story right. They'll get it back to me because Louis will kill me. Just a few announcements because that's how we pay the bills around here. That's why you know we have such a cheap set. Um, sidewalk sale, El Monte Valley Mall. That's Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, March 29th to the 31st. Sponsored by the Downtown El Monte Business Association. Want everybody to step on out there, support your local businesses at the Valley Mall. You can't do any wrong by that. Okay, at Mountain View Park on 12127 Elliott Avenue, El Monte, California, Saturday, March 30th, 2013, 9 a.m. to 12 noon. You are going to have Easter, Easter Family Fun Day. And the activities include arts and craft vendors, food vendors, information booth, Bob DeSena moving a microphone, moon bounce, face painting, bunny ears craft, game booths, opportunity drawing, carrot eating contest. I know Augie wants to join that. Ooh, yeah. Jelly Bean Guessing Jar and Zumba. You have breakfast with the Easter Bunny from 9 to 11 a.m. That's chorizo and eggs, scrambled eggs, beans, rolls, milk, and orange juice, $4. Easter Egg Hunt, 10 a.m., bring a bag. Three age divisions, four- and five-year-olds, first- and second-graders, and third- and fifth-graders. So they say hop on down. So remember, that is this Saturday, March 30th, at 12127 Elliott Avenue, El Monte, California, at Mountain View Park. Okay, and it gets better. El Monte Family Adventure Shuttle to Griffith Park Observatory. That's Saturday, April 20th. That's down the road. 2013, 10.30 a.m. Departure from El Monte Trolley Station. 4 p.m. Return shuttle, $5 per person. And shuttle ride only. The admission to Griffith Park Observatory is free. So you want to contact Public Works Department, 626-580-2227. And the last one is... 30th Annual Golf Classic, benefiting, and who is it benefiting? The Almani, South Almani Chamber of Commerce. All golfers receive a cart, range balls, goodie bag, and primary dinner. That is the California Country Club scramble format. Check in 11 a.m., tee off at 12.30. I think I'm getting a little teed off myself. Okay, so uh, contact Chamber of Commerce, phone 626-443-0180, okay? Oh, thank you. And here we are back again. That was a mouthful. And next to me is, if no one else, the lovely and talented Wendy. How are you doing, Wendy? Little round of applause. You can applaud for her. I tell you, man. And believe it or not, do not try to adjust your TV set. Yes, she has a doctorate in education. <laughs> and <laughs> unlike uh, most of us here, she's intellectual. Okay, and I won't mention any names. Don't look at Bob. Uh, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Boy, I know. I, I, you know what I love about Augie? Uh, he's great. He still counts with his toes. I love it. <laughs> See, he knows it. I tell you. So, so what's up, Thank doctor? You much. Where'd you get your doctorate from? I got it from USC mm -hmm. in educational leadership and educational psychology. Wow. And uh, let's see. Where else did you graduate from? You're going to love this. Um, I went to UC Irvine for my undergrad in social sciences, mm -hmm. when public and community service, and then I went on to Harvard for my master's. But I also, in the meantime, when I had time, I went to uh, beauty school and a little bit of law school, and that's pretty much it. Credential teacher, been in the schools, came out of it, still alive. And she's only 12 years old, folks. So 15, in mind. 15. 15, okay, she, got, she had a birthday there. Man, well, you know what? This is an inspiration for a lot of young people out there that don't want to stay through school. I got two students of my own that are here, and uh, one's on work release. The other one is, no, I'm just kidding. They're, <laughs> again, Isaac, Isaac gets all freaked out. No, he's a very talented young man. We're very blessed to have him here tonight. So what are you all about? What are you doing nowadays? Nowadays, um, I'm doing a lot of motivational speaking for college kids and high school kids, getting them into school 
getting them into college, making sure that they're off the streets and doing awesome things, like hopefully becoming professional people like this, musicians, you know, so we musicians work with Musicians aren't professional. Oh. oh. I'm sorry, I hate to break it to you. Oh, too. <laughs> I get, love you still. They get, they get paid <laughs> once in a while, but you know. <laughs> but yeah, so I work with a lot of youth in the community. So I work as a program director uh, at a nonprofit. So I work in substance abuse, gang prevention, child abuse. Now that you can work with them. The substance abuse. I, mean, I don't know. You guys are like the today's punching bag. What's going on? Uh, no, I Bob the center. I mean, he's wonderful. He's like the brother I never wanted. He's fantastic, man. Yeah. He's, yeah, he's, he's great. Let me tell you, man. Brother from he's, another mother. That's it. <laughs> no, he's, this is actually one of the greatest bands we have on the show. You know, it's ever been on the show. And, and we get a chance to go see him. He's still down there at Pips, right? Correct. And that's uh, where? La Brea? Uh, La Brea and Pico, 1356. Okay, 1356. So you want to go check them on out? Let me tell you, they're even better live. Every you know. Saturday night. Yes. Every Saturday night. Not every other, every Saturday mm -hmm. night. Okay? That's the second home for them. That's what it is. <laughs> so anyway, I didn't mean to. I had to segue, you know, because that's how these guys make their money. That way they can become professional. <laughs> that's okay. That's okay. We can share. You guys want to sit down? No? Lynn. Yes. Maybe? <laughs> Next to me. Lynn, Lynn, I can do it. He's like, ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. <laughs> Man, boy, barbarians in the house. I thought at the gate. So what do you do? I understand you do something here for Almani as well. Yeah, so we work with the youth to try to make sure that the police department, the city school districts, and everybody works together. And so hopefully what we can do is bring more activities out in the, in the youth um, adult type of arena and then make sure that they have something to do because we don't want them to be bored. We don't want them to not have something lively, something that encourages them to become like who they want to be. Well, that sounds good. We can get, we get a round of applause, but we're losing the audience right now. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's, that's actually why we bring the Bob to set a band, because they're good clappers. <laughs> oh, nice. You should get them, like, numbers, you know? One, ten. That's a like singing. Ten. 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 Yes. Yeah, let's hear it. Better not be like, doo doo doo. <laughs> yeah! Thank you so much. Yeah! <laughs> Sounds like it's yeah. It sounds like it's sizzling right now. Well, that's oh, that's great. It's wonderful what you're doing, and I'm glad. Mm -hmm. You know, the reason why we have Wen up here because she's going to be a new uh, addition to our family here at uh, beautiful Time Warner Channel Three, and also at the YouTube site. Uh, she was recently like on with uh, with Wendy, the healthier you, just mm -hmm. about a week ago, I believe it was, and now she's going to be helping us with a couple other shows, right? Yep, I agreed. Yes, she Find did. Find my life away. That's it. <laughs> Literally. Around here, that's what you're doing. <laughs> I tell you, man. So what's the future hold for you besides, you know, coming around and tormenting yourself with our channel? Mm -hmm. I don't know. Uh, I, I really still want to be a professor and then hopefully write books and get the word out to other youth and to motivate them. Um, I still love speaking. I love going out there and, and talking to a lot of people and making sure that they know what direction they want to go to. So it's to kind of like just guide them along the way. Right. So well, we'll see. We'll see. You're still young. It's unfolding as we speak. I don't know. We'll see. Yep, I tell you, man, this woman's got some skills, man. I, we had a conversation just recently and mm -hmm. blew me out of the water. So many ideas, man. You have a lot of good ideas that I think everybody could benefit from. Yeah. It's just remarkable, you know. And so we get ideas. We're going to step from the, you know, the sublime to the subliminal. Invite everyone. Cinco de Mayo, 5th of May at the Geek Theater. I mean, the Greek Theater. <laughs> Agi Roman will be playing with El Chicano, yeah. also Los Lobos, and, and Kinky. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. 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 Is that like a gang name? It's a band from Mexico. It's a rock and espanol, really good band. Oh, rock and espanol. Okay, well, it sounds pretty kinky. All right. <laughs> so, May 5th, a.k.a. Cinco de Mayo, over at the Greek Theater. So, you want to go check this brother out and see some of the talent. And uh, the El Chicano band, which was... One of the, originally founded by one of my best buddies who passed away no longer with us, uh, Mr. Bob, Bobby Espinosa. And we love you, Bobby, and we know you're watching yeah. and laughing. So, you know, can I get a plot? Bobby's yeah. all right, he's still here. Yeah, he was our, uh, Bobby was our music director of my old show for like four years. Mm -hmm. And he kept bringing Augie around, I don't know why. <laughs> yeah, we got Bobby right here. There's Bobby here, but I don't know if you can see him on the shine. Yeah. And we got him here with Carlos Mancia. You can't see him back here, but, you know, he and Carlos Mancia had a good time. Mm -hmm. I heckled them all night. Anyway. So this is really good. I'm glad you're going to be able to co-host with me uh, tonight. Okay. It'll be really good to have. You know, the young lady that uh, is going to be coming up next is uh, Maggie Ramirez. She's the one that's eventually going to be doing the, the children's show for our channel as well. She's doing a show for herself, 
and then she'll be doing it. And I saw some of her pictures. I went to your Facebook to see your pictures of uh, Snow White. That was cool. <laughs> so, so she's yeah. going to do some, some major damage. And this is going to be your educational consultant. I hope you realize that. So it's, it's a family operation, folks. We're best friends already. Yeah. I figured yeah. as much. We're soul sisters. Soul like sisters, this. right? It's like me and Augie. Yeah. <laughs> Soul sisters. <laughs> <laughs> Soul sisters. Every simple little remark. Show me your French ring. Your friendship ring. Friendship <laughs> ring. Or at least your mood ring. No, we like having fun with that, you know, just and uh, teasing people out there. We're, once again, I want to thank uh, the Amani City Council for sponsoring us here. Let's give them a round of applause for Amani City Council. Yay! And our mayor, Andre Quintero, they do a grand, bang up job. They're going through like a lot of changes right now, trying to renovate the city, making it look sweet and take care of it and let me tell you I, I wouldn't want to have their job if, if they paid me in fact they don't pay me anything but uh it's really nice to be here and we do the show and be able to bring this information out there for the city of Almonte. we got some other information that's gonna be coming your way real soon but we're gonna be doing it and increasing the the input because and output because people want to know what's going on here in Almonte. and i know my students know they grew up here they know that Almonte always gets a bad rap People always talk about them, you know, and all that stuff. And but it's a it's a beautiful city. I mean, where else could you find a show like this? Who'd put up with us? Mm -hmm. I tell you, man. That's, you know, that's the truth. And speaking of putting up with people, I think it's time <laughs> for the Bob the Santa Band to delight us with another song. And this one will be even longer, probably 15 minutes. <laughs> Woo! You got a lot of time to fill in. Oh, yeah. That's what you think. I want to take it back to the 1970s. A group called the Classic Six. This is I want you to figure that out.
Senna does it all, man. He's like what we used to call triple threat. <laughs> Sings. He, he even danced a little bit. Wasn't he dancing yeah. or was he having an attack or what? Okay. <laughs> okay, I just want to make sure. I didn't know he missed his meds or something. No? <laughs> <laughs> I just heard that snore. <laughs> <laughs> I think we have fun here. He's on morning tonight, man. <laughs> <laughs> you know, we like to get the information out, but we also like to have a good time. We hope you have a good time at home as well. Well, this is the shades of the old East LA studio. I'm gonna do it all old school here because we're mi one mic short and a dollar less. So, <laughs> next to me is the other lovely and talented, charming star we have here, Maggie Ramirez Zipper. Thank you, thank you, thank you for having me here. It's a pleasure to be here again. It's on. Go ahead. It's on. Yes. It Tell is. us a little bit about yourself. Um, well, uh, my name is Maggie Ramirez, and I'm the founder of the OM Peace Center and the OM Wellness Center of here, El Monte, California. And um, we do many things there, as you were able to see today. We, we, I give um, abundance and prosperity workshops, and I also uh, teach uh, people how to live a peaceful and pleasant life. I teach them how to meditate. And um, at the Wellness Center, we take care of the physical part of, of a being and, and make sure that they're balanced and and good to go. So, yes. See, we have to play Mike here. You know, I tell you. A little round of applause for this young lady. I mean, she's doing something very spectacular. And I'll, the next question I have to ask, do you think you can help any of these guys? They need a little bit of centeredness. <laughs> hey, look at them. Yeah, look at them. <laughs> tell us. I feel better already. Absolutely. Yes. Um, as soon as I'm done here, I'll take each and every one of you into, you know, the sacred room and balance you out. And wow. <laughs> <laughs> see, you can't even do it. No, see, they're getting a little weird. Is it one at a time? Like, no, no. We went and we were very blessed. Uh, Valerie and I went out there and we got to see her wellness center. And let me tell you, it's a fabulous, very spiritual kind of place because when you go there, it's very soothing. It's calming. It's almost like the Bob DeSena music. In fact, I was talking because they're going to have festivals coming up. And I told them they can invite you guys. Mm -hmm. You guys yes, would be perfect. Yes, we, we get to work together. We're, um, we're going to be having a, a peace movement. It's called the Yitzi Movement. And um, it's going to be actually a worldwide movement. But we're going to be celebrating part of it here in El Monte. And I would love to have you guys come and be part of the weekend. It's a weekend celebration. It's June the 22nd and the 20, 23rd. Of, uh, of this year and 
we are going to have a weekend of peace celebration and we want everyone that's interested in connecting with that inner peace to come and celebrate with us and a band like yours with such talent and beauty we would love to to sing with you wait a minute wait a minute. i gotta ask beauty <laughs> i'm trying to figure out who she was talking about <laughs> oh, guys oh be yeah beautiful. guys can be beautiful right <laughs> no no that's <laughs> no, Augie, no, Augie is beautiful. He is beautiful. I just can't figure what kind of beauty. But we'll, we'll figure it out. You get to focus on the inner peace. Oh. You get to focus on the inner peace. Okay. Well, I, I figured it right. He's staring inside, inside, inside inner shirt beauty. Right oh, the inner, there you go. The inner beauty. Want to make sure. Be, be oh, Augie, oh. No, don't go there. Don't go there. I don't want to see myself. That's oh, my goodness. <laughs> You know, this is a family show, bro. It Come on. It's a family show. What are you guys thinking? And, and we have it at dinner time, okay? People are eating, okay? <laughs> yes, well, you, you guys get to come down to the Wellness Center one of these days, and we will balance out all of your chakras and balance all of your bodies out in a good way. Okay. Yeah? Thank you. And balance your checkbooks. You know, we have it all said. Because I know you guys need all the help you get. I tell you, man. You guys, this, this is one of those sillier show. Look at it. We got Jamie popped out. You guys are too much. But let me tell you, no, it's really a, uh, you know, if you get a chance to visit this location and, and take advantage of all the, you know, activities there, and they're very nice and soothing and very corrective, I should say, uh, please do and support them. Because this is part of your local business here in beautiful Almania, and they're actually in the same building of the uh, Chamber of Commerce, yes. which I was surprised because I never knew it was there. And we were talking to uh, Councilman Vicky today, who she said told me to tell you hi, okay? And she got really jazzed about it, and she goes, I got to find her a bigger space. Oh, wow. That's what she's, trying, that's what she's doing, but I should, maybe I shouldn't tell tales out of school, huh? Right. <laughs> well, Vicky, thank you very much for thinking of us, and we will find a bigger place as soon as our community comes together and mm -hmm. supports what we're doing, supports... Finding that inner peace supports being well, because that's what we're focused on here in El Monte is, you know, the wellness, right? Yep. With Wendy over here is, you know, a better you, a uh, healthier you, right? So um, at the Wellness Center, that's another thing that we're focused on. And at the Peace Center, we have also yoga on Mondays for the community. It's based on donations as well. 